Good morning, everybody. It's just a beautiful sunrise. The sun's coming up behind me and been out here in the in the garden, just uh, being blessed by God's presence. And you know, we're going to be making more and more of these these kinds of videos. And I just really want to get started by just sharing, you know, how it all started with us. And in 1999, Tanya and I. You know, uh, we had been together as a couple for five years. We were we were not churchy people. We we weren't religious, and as a matter of fact, we were drug drug addicted, alcohol addicted. Our relationships uh, were dysfunctional with everybody in our lives, including our relationship with each other. And you know, our life just had reached a place that uh, we knew we needed something more than what, you know, we were able to give each other just of our own ability. And so we we were given a witness by a man named Jim Wilkins who told us that, you know, we needed God in our lives or just things weren't going to work. And so it was at that point that, that we made a decision that we wanted a relationship with, with our Lord Jesus. And we invited him into our hearts. I invited him into my heart and he transformed me. You know, my life, my, my life was full of darkness and pain and suffering. But, you know, when Jesus came in, it just lifted that burden, that burden that I have been trying to carry myself, you know, that, that uh, just separation from my creator that I knew instinctively I, I was just wrong. And when Jesus came in, everything became right. And, you know, life became right. Life came back, you know, into its its purpose and its meaning began to, to be real to us. And, and now we've been living for the Lord for almost 22 years. And, uh, you know, do I still get sick? Yes. Do I still have troubles? Yes. Do I still have little Yorkies that bark a lot? Yes. But you know what? God's with us and through it all, you know, I've learned to trust in him and I've learned to know that, you know, this God that ordered the sun to come up every morning and it's still obedient. I need to be the same as God's son that when he orders me to do something that, you know, I just, I just follow his direction. I don't question him or the thing he's asking me to do. I just do it. And, you know, I know some people can't understand that, but it's part of what we do here in our, on our farm and in our lives is just trust God. And I want to encourage you, you need to learn how to trust God in your life. And our God has a name. His name is Jesus of Nazareth, and he loves you, and he wants a relationship with you. That your journey to forever with Jesus start today. Ask him into your heart. Amen.